So, bubble and squeak, right? It's mega. Using your leftovers, and I'm gonna just show you a great way to collect a load of flavors, bring them together, make it beautiful and tasty. So, I've just fried off some bacon. I've reserved two rashes to garnish the dish, and the rest I've cut up. So now, I've collected all my leftovers out of the fridge, and I'm gonna to bring together the bubble and squeak. So a bowl, then mashed potato. Let's take a handful of mash. Then I've got some cabbage. So just roughly chop it, just a couple of times. In that goes. We've got some sweet corn that's left over. Now with these bad boys, what I want you to do is we're gonna take shards off, which will look really cool, and it beats getting it out of a tin. And in that goes. Bacon, just drop that in. Add some diced red onion to the bowl some baby leaf spinach that's not cooked. Just gonna cut it up nice and thin. And then in that goes. Seasoning, salt and pepper. Not too much because you've got the bacon going in. Flat leaf parsley, just take a good twist and then we're just gonna cut that up nice and fine. Then drop the parsley in. Pinch of chili flakes and about a teaspoon of garlic. And then finally, to give it a little bit more kick, some smoked paprika. You want about a teaspoon. And now we're going to incorporate all those ingredients. Okay, and then the bacon fat from earlier, I'm just going to add that in as well. So now we're going to work those into some nice patties. So I'm using the same pan I did the bacon in, so there's a little bit of bacon fat left in there. And then I'm just going to add a little bit of oil in there as well. I'm using rapeseed oil. And then get your bubble and squeak pancake and drop that in. So those bad boys are in, they're sizzling straight away. They're going to get a nice caramelised on the outside. Going to about a minute and a half on one side, flip them and do the other side. And now I'm going to make a really quick, simple sweet corn relish. So, a tablespoon of sweet chilli sauce. Then we need some Moscatel wine vinegar, a full tablespoon of sweet corn. Drop those in and let's give them a razz. So once you've done that, whiz it and then just taste it. Delicious. So, a few chili flakes and a teaspoon of flat leaf parsley. Now just look how beautiful that goes. You've got the chili flakes bright red, then you've got the beautiful green, and then they've got the yellow from the sweet corn. Dead simple, gorgeous. Okay, so when those bad boys are done, take them out and let them chill out. And now we're gonna fry an egg. Okay, so we're gonna plate up now. And then with your beautiful sweet corn relish, just get a little bit of that. And we're just gonna drizzle round, okay? So that's my bubble and squeak with the egg and the crispy bacon, little bit of paprika on the egg, and then that beautiful, really simple sweet corn relish. Boom. <laughs>